All right, Legends, welcome back. In this video, we're gonna talk about how to change our frame rate from the Final Cut Pro custom default settings. So what do we do? Well, let's go ahead and create a new project. So I'm gonna go ahead and click new project just like that. And by default, this video property should be clicked just like that. What you're gonna to wanna to do is click on custom. Now let's talk about, okay, so format, 1080 HD, that's what I want. I want the P, I don't want the I. I don't like I at all, P is way better. Um, I do not have, a camera that supports up to 4K right now. Resolution, yes, I want it 19, 20 by 1080. Uh, some pixels aren't all the same. You can click this route. The pixels, some of the pixels and width are gonna be more rectangular than square, so it's gonna be kind of like a wider look. I do not want that. And then frame rate. If you have a camera that supports 60p, click on this. It's good. It's very smooth transitioning. I have a camera that supports 60i, which is equivalent to this right here. I'm still gonna show you the difference between um, 29.98 and 24, but why would you wanna change this? If you have a camera that supports 60p, not 60i, 60p, and it would be ideal if you wanted to take it to like a sporting event or like a NASCAR or anything where there's motion, it's gonna be really crisp. There's gonna be 60 frames per second as opposed to this, which is pretty much half the amount of frames. So it's gonna be a lot more blurry when things are going fast. Uh, 24 frames per second, that's like the cinematic look. And I have two videos right now. Um, let's go ahead and check it out. So yeah, 29.97, this is kind of like the home video look, the YouTube look, 24 is more cinematic and 60 frames I would use for uh, sporting events. Maybe if you wanted to film like nature, like animal planet and really wanted to get down and dirty with animals moving and stuff like that. I would definitely buy a camera that supports 60p and I would crank this all the way up. So let's see if we can just tell the difference right now between, and again, to reiterate, I have 60i, which is equivalent to this right here. So this is it right here. Let's go ahead and bounce out of this. Now keep in mind, this is a picture of a picture. So I don't know how, I can clearly see the difference. The 29, pretty much 30 frames per second is a lot crisper than, I've got two projects up here. Uh, where are they at, where are they at? I've got a 24 and I've got a 60, don't, that's, that's 60i though. So it's really 24p and 29p. So let's go ahead and click on the, the 29 one. Let's click on me and let's see if we can tell the difference. It's more of kind of like a documentary look. <clears throat> hey, what's going on guys? CH from Village Park Source. Just, uh, hey, what's going on guys? It's CH from Village Park Source. Just to say that uh, congratulations for those who made it to this 40th video. Great job. Pretty clean. That's still pretty clean. 29 frames per second. Now let's look at 24. It's gonna be a lot more choppier. It's gonna be, I guess they call it that cinematic look. Um, all, there's no right or wrong. It's just kind of what going of style video you're going for. Obviously, if you want to get that super good, good, good slow motion, uh, I'd recommend upgrading a camera or if you already have a camera that supports 60p and going with that. I don't really mess around with stuff like that. Maybe I should do a video, dedicate a whole new video just on frame rate, when, why and where you should use it and change it. But let's get back into it. Okay, so here's my 24 frames per second. Did I double click on that. 24 frames per second. <clears throat> hey, what's going on guys? CH from Village Park Source. Just, uh, hey, what's going on guys? It's CH from Village Park Source. A lot Source. choppier, that, uh, doesn't look as clean. those who made it this 40th video. Doesn't look as smooth. Let's go back to 60. <clears throat> hey, what's going on guys? CH from Village Park Source. Just, uh, hey, what's going on guys? It's CH from Village Park Source. This is definitely smoother, but again, there's no right or wrong. Which style of video are you trying to go for? You be the judge, let me know in the comment section. If you guys have any questions or comments, I think this, I think I might have written my notes down not as good as I have in previous videos for this video. Hopefully this made sense. 60 frames per second, fast, fast, fast motion. Uh, uh, 30, 29, 30 frames per second. The YouTube standard, 24 frames per second. Uh, cinematic look. Good luck with that. I'll see you guys in the next video where we talk about video animation.